with my students or with the family and uh, a little garden of flowers. And uh, it could be an image of maybe the, the joy that we will experience when our time on this earth is over. And when God calls us to the eternal banquet, so there will be no more fear, no more sadness, no more sorrow, only enjoying all that God has provided for us. No wonder we were able to listen to the wonderful voice of Stanley proclaiming for us, do not let your hearts be troubled. When we think that uh, we're in the arms of our loving Saviour, there is no need worried about anything. And in his own way, Christopher was certainly aware that Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. The trust in our loving God, we commend him now and give thanks to Julia and Mark for looking after Christopher in such a wonderful way making sure that he is able to gain his independence and uh, be there and uh, play an active life in the community. I invite you to stand now as we prepare to offer our prayers <coughs> for Christopher and for the whole church. Christ is Son from the dead. With confidence we ask him to save all his people, living and dead. Our brother Christopher was free to his baptism received eternal life. May he enjoy the company of the saints forever. Lord, hear us. Lord, Lord graciously hear us. Christopher was nourished by Christ's body, the bread of eternal life. May he rise again on the last day. Lord, hear us. Lord, Lord graciously hear us. Let us pray for the souls of our families, relations and benefactors. May they receive the reward of their labours. Lord, hear us. Lord, Lord graciously hear us. Let us pray for all who sleep in the hope of resurrection. And we remember especially Christopher's family. May they be brought into the light of God's presence. Lord, hear us. Lord, Lord graciously hear us. Let us pray for all who have come here today to pray in the spirit of faith. May we attain to the kingdom of glory. Lord, hear us. Lord, Lord graciously hear us. We ask Mary, the mother of God, to pray with us as we say. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour for death. Amen. shelter and our strength, you listen in love to the cry of your people. <clears> Through <throat> the prayers we offer for our departed brother Christopher, cleanse him and all the faithful departed of their sins and grant them the fullness of redemption. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. <laughs> 